Hi, and thanks for choosing to watch this C-Logic video in which we'll look at working with marketing campaigns within the SalesLogix web client. In another C-Logic video, we looked at how to add and launch a campaign, and in this video we'll take a look at adding campaign responses, associating an opportunity to a campaign, and how everything relates back to that campaign to show campaign metrics. So here we have a campaign that was launched against a target audience who all received an email. You would hope that these targets either phone up to express an interest, or you would proactively follow up with them to gauge interest levels. Either way, you want to record responses, so you can monitor the effectiveness of your campaign. There are a couple of ways to do this. Let's say a target called Dave Adams phones in, and a sales representative takes the call. The salesperson would navigate to Dave's contact record, and be able to see from the marketing tab that he has been targeted in the Dell Email Blast campaign. Now you can simply edit the entry and fill in the information to note a response. It should be stressed that this is logging a response, but you can also specify the status of the response if it happens that an opportunity is added, for example. When complete, click OK. Notice now that the marketing campaign status is responded. But if I go to the responses tab, I can actually see the details of the response. This is an important distinction as it means you can add a response to a campaign that has no targets or this contact has not been targeted in. A good example of this might be a newspaper advert where no targets are defined and as people call up to express an interest, you can log that response. Simply click on the green plus sign and now choose the campaign and fill in all the information. If I now go back to my original Dell Email Blast campaign that I logged the response for Dave for and look at my Responses tab, I can now see Dave Adams is now listed. I can also add responses from my target list. A marketeer may do this as they may have received a list of interested people, let's say, from a trade show campaign. In the target list, simply change the status to responded and the usual add response box pops up to be filled in. You could also select a multiple number of records and use the update targets button on the right hand side of the screen. Once again my responses list grows and if I go to the budgets results tab I can see my response metrics. As far as opportunities are concerned you can link an opportunity to a campaign. Going to Harry Bell of the American Mixing Company's contact record I can see from the marketing tab that he has been on the receiving end of three campaigns and also from the Responses tab that he has responded to two of them. The status of the Dell Email Blast response has been set to Closed Opportunity Created, so I can go to that opportunity and ensure it is associated with the campaign. Hyperlink to the opportunity and click on the Marketing tab, and then click the green plus sign. Now look up the specific campaign you want to link the opportunity to, highlight it and click OK. The campaign and opportunity are now associated. 
If I go back to my campaign and click on the Opportunities tab, I can now see the opportunity I've just associated along with any other associated opportunities as well. Back in my Budgets Results tab, we can see the Opportunities quadrant and the cost metrics begin to take shape so you can track your return on marketing investment. Each of these quadrants is explained in more detail in the Help screen. Other things to consider are a campaign summary report that you can use or you could write additional crystal reports. Back in the campaign itself, you can copy a campaign, which is useful if you are running similar monthly or quarterly campaigns, and you may want to track your campaign based on end date using Group Builder, and also make it inactive at the relevant time. So there we have it, marketing campaigns and working with them in sales logics. Target a large number of people, track their responses, create opportunities, win the deals and track it all in the campaigns area and report on the return of your marketing campaign gave you. Remember to always read the help files if you have any problems but in the meantime thanks for watching this C-Logic video.